Hey guys, welcome to Vlogmas. Uh, hey guys, and welcome to vlog uh, vlog uh, blah, blah. Hey guys, and welcome to vlog vlog uh, Psych. Hey guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 6. So this Vlogmas Day 6 video will be my November favourite. So let's just get straight into the video. So I'm going to start with my favourite clothing item of the month. I did purchase this dress from Ali. And it was $30. It's like a midi sole dress. And it looks so good. And it sucks everything in. Just the material. Just, yeah, snatches you right up. And that's the print. So my favorite supplements. I've been using these for the F45 eight-week challenge. So I've been using them for six weeks now. It's a protein powder and a ZMA. Either from True, a company that is, I think, more of a natural-based uh, supplement company. I find that I've had natural protein before and I haven't liked it. And I love this one. This one is a coffee flavor. I actually got my protein right here. And I have a French vanilla one. So every day you need to have a protein shake or sometimes these would be put into your smoothies. A one kilo bag is about $70. So I find that price pretty good considering you can get protein powders for that price and they don't taste good. Uh, ZMA, so you take a scoop of this before you go to bed. It says about 30 minutes before you go to sleep and it helps you have a good night's sleep. I've had the best sleep for the past six weeks since I've been taking this. It's just got like a lemon flavor to the water. You just put it in water. Um, and magnesium is really good for you. It helps you recover as well. So if you're working out and you want a good recovery, and I find that I'm recovering so well from definitely weights when I take my ZMA because it's got the magnesium in it. I also wanted to throw in something weird, but my favorite food item of the month so I've been sticking to the plan, but there are occasions where you do need a bread. I've been using this bread. I think it's called Bergen. I use the soy lin or the rye. Um, it's got like all these seeds in it. It's a small slice and I do believe it's one of the healthier options of bread on the market. But for a sm small pack, it's about five dollars and i'm pretty sure you can get this in any supermarket i just get mine from coles or woolies so my favorite beauty item of the month is is the micellar water the garnier skin active one i have seen this all over instagram youtube facebook it's been out for a little bit now um and i just never was interested in it and then this was like for sale for like three dollars in coles and i thought i'll get a tester and see if i like it and I use it to remove makeup or just to remove like the dirt when I go walking or go to the gym and that you get a build up on the face. So yeah, I really, really like this. I think the big bottle is like six or seven dollars. So once this is finished, I will get a bigger bottle. So I have written down my favorites on a piece of paper. So if I look down, that is why, because the next one is my favorite TV shows. I do have a few that I want to mention. So I've been watching a lot of Netflix and I have just finished up The Sinner with Jessica Bill in it. And oh my God, it is really, 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 really good. Um, it's got a massive plot twist. And cause at first you're like, yeah. and then at the end you're like, Something I love so much, and it was on YouTube, is the Demi Lovato Simply Complicated. I am obsessing over Demi Lovato. She's so freaking hot. Um, yeah, so I've got a major girl crush on you, Demi Lovato. This documentary is of her process of making this new album and dealing with her mental illness. And it was a really good insight into her. So I just found it a really well-presented documentary about mental illness. And I just feel like a lot of people, like Demi Lovato, you can't hate her. And I just love her. So two more things. One is on Netflix and one is on Stan. On Stan, Claws. I've seen little things about this show on um, Instagram because Karichi is in it. So it's just based around a nail salon who cleans dirty money for a drug lord, drug 
gang. Really good storyline, really good acting. I'm waiting for season two to come out. I'm not sure when that will come out. But yes, Claw. I really finished that whole season within a week. I loved it so much. And something that I have fallen back in love with. <gasps> and it was The Blacklist. For some reason, we just stopped watching it. I think we got confused for where we were up to. So we just stopped watching it. And I was like, you know what? We have nothing else to watch. Uh, let's figure out where we're up to. And we have fallen back in love with it. We watch it every night. We do have like set shows for the week that we watch. We watch Don't Be Tardy, uh, Real Housewives of Atlanta, no, Real Housewives of New Jersey. Uh, I watch Will and Grace, but that's finished now. And then we watch The Blacklist every night. So yes, and Longmire is coming back to Netflix for its final season. So if you haven't seen Longmire, I really, really recommend it. Um, it was just something that we randomly picked on Netflix and we smashed all the seasons so quickly. So it's so overexposed. The sun is coming out right now. And to finish up this, to finish up this favorites video is my favorite song. I don't have a favorite song for now. I do have a favorite album and I have already mentioned her, Demi Lovato. Her album, Tell Me You Love Me. I listen to it like over and over and over again and then like you just start knowing all the words, singing along and I've got Zendaya dancing to the songs. I think it's a really raw album. It's fantastic. I love it so much. Good work Demi Lovato. I just really think like Demi Lovato and I can be my best friends. So I hope you have a wonderful day. Make sure you like and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. Pew! <laughs>